The UMass Minutemen. What do you got them at? They went four and eight last year. Hold on. Four <laughs> and eight last year. Three offensive returning starters, three defensive returning starters. The last place team as far as experience in the entire country. Number 130. New head coach Walt Bell, former OC at Florida State last year, which was garbage. That was a good job. Uh, at Maryland before that. Mm, I mean, they beat Texas. So. Uh, Arkansas State. Yeah, that was that. Before that. That was that head coach's offense, not. Agreed. Uh, takes over for Mark Whipple, who went 16 and 44 his last five years there. He was much more successful back in the early 2000s. And 16 and 44. 44, yeah. Number 34 total offense last year, but they lose their top passer, their top receiver, their top rusher, three out of five offensive linemen, and uh, their Juco quarterback, uh, Andrew Brito, did not arrive until this summer. So he hadn't even had a chance to learn this offense yet. Uh, number 123 in total defense last year. Number 127 in scoring defense loses all three starters uh, on the defensive line. But Penn State grad transfer linebacker Jarvis Miller should make some kind of an impact. I mean, that's a, that's a pretty big name to get, right? Even though he was uh, second team, he was a backup at Penn State. But here he's going to be the dude. So uh, Bell relying on a ton of JUCO help. They, they signed seven JUCO guys out of 21 commits in the 2018 class. The schedule, the lack of experience, means a rough first year for Walt Bell. I got him 1-11. I got him beating Southern Illinois. I got him losing to everybody else. I got him 2-10. I, I, I have no idea where they'll find two wins. but I mean, the, the back part of this schedule, like Liberty at Army at Northwestern BYU, like they, they play at Rutgers, at Charlotte, Coastal Carolina, Akron, at FIU, at Louisiana Tech, I mean, UConn. Rutgers, Coastal like, Carolina aren't juggernauts. No, but... They're better than UMass, ooh, but could they win one of those games? Sure. Yeah, they could, yeah. 111, <laughs> 2 and 10, absolutely. All right, that's going to wrap up the independence. Of course, share the show out. Go to winningcureseverything.com. Go to betnow.eu. We'll see you guys next time. Thanks for checking out Winning Cures Everything. If you want to keep up with us, hit subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. Visit the website at winningcureseverything.com or you can like us on Facebook or follow us at Winning Cures, at Gary WCE, or at Chris B. Giannini on Twitter. Share out the show, leave a nice review, and make sure to comment and tweet at us.